I'm Tony, and I'm currently 15% body fat. Why are you trying to get me to say what I am? I'm Nicole, and I'm currently 37% body fat. <laughs> Even when you feel low, you can still go. Even when you feel slow, you can still go. Even when there's no hope, you can still go. I never answer to no man, I still go. Go, go. And we are making our way but to a healthy it lifestyle is together. In my blood. Ooh, that's where all of the black women be at. In the butt, in the butt. <laughs> Your butt is so juicy. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Good morning, vlog. I am Tony Fine, your fine fit sister, and welcome to another day in my life as I get ready for my first ever bikini bodybuilding show that is in literally 30 days exactly. This morning I'm making some breakfast, so let's see. Got just some egg whites, some asparagus. I need to measure out some flax seed and get this party going. First, I need a plate. Okay, what do we have on the menu today? It is 6.15 a.m. I'm getting ready to get on TikTok live and do my daily live stream where we just talk about weight loss and common misconceptions and helping people create a healthy, balanced relationship with food through portion control. You know the deal. Um, and then after that, I have a virtual call with my bikini, my suit maker, the lady who made my, who's making my two suits for my competition. I have to try them on for her. So we can make sure we got the fit right. And then after that, I gotta go to the gym. This is like, like, yeah, this will just be like a full bikini day. I might do a little bit of like what I eat. Like right now, you just see me Um, I always burn the egg white pan. But, what else? Today they also have, um, yeah, talk to Maria, go to the gym. Then right after the gym, I have my sports massage. I have to get a sports massage like every week now to help like look leaner for the show, but also because it's pretty taxing, the workouts and, and you know, everyday grind. And then, after that, I have a DEXA scan, see what my body fat is. It's been a long time since I got my body fat tested, so fingers crossed. I just measured my weight this morning. Right now, before any food is in it. It's coming in at 25 inches. Can you see? A little less which is crazy. I used to be 225 pounds. Now my waist is less than 25 inches. Crazy. Anywho, so I'm gonna take you guys with me. Not too much, but let's see what I'm getting ready to eat. I'm gonna put some Danos, low sodium, zero calorie seasoning on it. Dang, what else is on it? Mm, no. Okay, I'm gonna eat this, get on live, pick you guys back up when I'm on the phone with Maria, or Purify, whatever this was, but too much. Too much, too much. A lot of loss. All right, here we go. Before I say So I'm gonna put this in the microwave, and once I'm finished with live, and I'm finished with my bikini suit stuff, I'm going to put it on, turn it on, then go ahead and um, eat it real quick before I go to the gym. All right, let's go live. Let's see. Hey Siri, play Sweet Home Alabama. I gotta start drinking tea. I talk so much on live that I be losing my voice. But that's okay, we gonna keep pushing through. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Okay, I'm gonna have to set y'all down in a minute. Good morning, I'm on the vlog right now, you guys. I can't hear sweet home. Hey Siri, turn it up a notch. Just got off live. It's 8.55, getting ready to put on my suits. All right, we are actually on the phone now and she had me tighten everything up to do my posing. All right, I am 
Ooh, it's 9.22. Call went good, it was fast. Eating this meal, what, which one? But yeah, I'ma eat my food. My energy gun immediately lift, cause I need carbs before I go to the gym. Work out. Mm. And massage. Getting ready to go to the gym. Hello. Not my voice being gone. All right, I'm on here looking for. I got to the gym two minutes late. Let's see. I'll be praying. Okay, have a good day. Why I left this thing on? Anywho, you guys, I just finished my workout. It was tense. It's 10:30. It's just a 30-minute um workout. Okay, cool. <sighs> What do we do? Upper body, like your shoulders. Normally I stay here later and then I do additional work, but I gotta go to my massage right now, so let go. Actually, let me go ahead and drink my protein. It's just a scoop of regular protein in water because I just have my workout. When you pump, you wanna immediately fill your muscles with protein, so immediately afterwards. If you don't like protein powder, this is the only time I drink protein powder. If I don't have time for a meal, like I would eat four pieces of chicken instead, four ounces of chicken instead. Anyway. Yes, okay. It Now we are finished the workout, headed to a sports massage. I call it that because it's a massage, but low key it's like a beat up kind of situation. It's it's a situation where you might want to get a massage after the massage. I should do before and afters because a lot of people do before and afters to kind of show you like what your, their body looks like before and after the massage because it's so much more muscle definition after it. Okay, y'all. Oops. I'm in, um, I'm actually at home in this old nasty uh, wife beater <laughs> because my appointment was not to not at the hour I was there. So I thought my appointment was 11 o'clock, which is the time that I normally go, but it was actually 12:45. I forgot that he had to change the time from the normal time, whatever. So I go to the sports massage place, and I'm like, he don't come out because he I gotta wait for him to come out. And I was like, oh, fuck. I checked, my appointment is not for two more hours. So I tried to reschedule and call, but he was in a session, I'm guessing. So I went ahead and booked another one and then even left in a note like, oh, if I need to pay a cancellation fee, cause I cancel, just let me know. I hate paying cancellation fees. It, I mean, are you supposed to? But also, like, what the fuck? I'm about to come back in two more days. You really gonna charge me the whole fee right now? Like, you could do that. But if you do it, it's my fault. I know it's my fault. But at the same time, if I pay for a whole service and I didn't get no service, you ain't gonna see me again. I'm just being honest. Um... And he's pretty chill, and I always like over tip and everything like that. So I know it ain't no beef between us. And the kind of spot it is, he like ran out of spot amongst like a bunch of people. So I left a message, little bitch, call me back. No offense, ma'am, little bitch, call me back. And she was like, oh, she was very snarky on the phone, very smart, snarky. Like, oh, um, I guess we won't do it this time, but normally we charge a cancellation fee. And you know, we always send out messages, so you just wanna make sure you're watching the correct time, whether you can make it or you can't. Like real, like, bitch, I hear what you, I hear what the fuck you saying. I said, I told him I would pay a cancellation fee if there's one. Oh no, we're not gonna charge it. Well, why is you taking me over the coal, over this shit? If you're not gonna charge me a fee, why are you trying to make me feel bad? Like, ooh, watch out, bitch. Next time it'll be a fee. Will it be the last motherfucking time I walk up in this bitch? So just you watch out. Damn. We're on our way to get our DEXA scan. I just posted a TikTok video. Like, part of me is hoping it does well, but I don't want the backlash that I think will come from it, which is just saying black women are the fattest women in the country, Damn. which is a Fendi fact. Okay, backlash. Backlash. I so, thought you said the test was going to say that, but you're saying you're saying that. 
42 no it, the numbers came out 42 percent of americans are obese over 30 percent bmi 62 percent of black women are obese which means black women are the fattest and that's only because it's kids who be small that's really helping us yeah our kids be, your nails are good Merci. no i love that um which is a fact it's a fact of not copyright anyway it's your reality of my life of most of i mean if you watching this almost half of americans is obese so i know you know somebody right and then everybody is like well i like being thick i like being thick okay bitch you could like being thick all you want to be miss thickums but it's the infertility it's the cancer it's the diabetes it's the high blood pressures it's the health issues associated with the obesity but i think the backlash you'll get some people will say well the bmi, a BMI is scale is based on da 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 mm -hmm. and then you'll get the crazies who just say they big bone mm -hmm. but which it it be fake until you like it it's good until you like the results. Because mm -hmm. I, I I said in the video too, I said I was queen. That number don't mean nothing to me. Uh -huh. That's for white women. Uh -huh. yeah. BMI. I'm supposed to be thick. White women supposed to be small. That's what I would say. That's what so many of us say. Even um when right. I say that in the chat, right. the the Latinas be like, yep, that ain't for us. Okay, oh okay. They be like, damn, I want to be just like them. They up and they moving. They running around. <laughs> So maybe, uh, so I want people to hear it. Don't be so offended because I, I mean, come on. What we gonna do? We just gonna be mad at each other. We not gonna talk about it at all. Cool, whatever. Anywho, let's go get our body fat tested, period. And I'm only getting it done because Nicole was like, she want to get hurt. Like, you got money? Can I cash up you? Yeah, I put it on my card. Okay, I ain't even got my card. I got the wrong purse. <laughs> not the wrong purse. <laughs> First, I do some paperwork. <laughs> what the best? It's too long. Why are we getting a scan for Because we've seen it online. Oh yeah, because we get body fat tests done, but like um with another little machine, this like seems like to be one. the most. Yeah, so it's obviously. it's actually like the most accurate. Yeah, yeah, it's the gold standard for everything. Ah. And that's my hips. <laughs> oh, I'm when you're it. losing, for one, this is five pounds of fat, which is blubbery. Do you have the comparison of like muscle? muscle? I don't have it no. no, but I've been talking about getting one. So. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, uh, but yes, five pounds of muscle takes up way less space um, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. in reference to that. I mean, in terms of muscle, it's much more dense, so it's gonna take up a lot less space than fat does. Um, that's why somebody can weigh almost exactly the same, but change their entire body composition, so. So when you're losing weight, what do you want to lose? If you're overweight, obese, what do you want to lose? Ideally fat, ideally abdominal fat first, and then um, any gains in muscle also further improves your percentages. So even though we talk about fat loss and improving your body fat percentage, it is a measure of body fat um, and muscle mass. So if you add a couple pounds of muscle mass and decrease body fat, that you know, further improves your percentage. So I like to say that being in a small calorie deficit but eating adequate protein, yeah. building more muscle is ideal for getting to your weight Absolutely. loss goals, but also by, yeah. okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, perfect. Very good, oh my goodness. That is five pounds of fat. I'm so glad um, we can. Pro tip, do not wear jeans because that's gonna mess up the bone density part of this. So what's the even more pro tip? Okay, wear underwear. That's why your mom said wear clearly underwear because I wear, okay, turn it on, turn it on. <laughs> She said that and I went to check. I'm like, oh, I don't think I have any on. <laughs> Let me save it as a draft. I messed up earlier. Have a good scan. Where the hell are you going? Right here. Hey, you got my camera to face down. All right, this is here. Mm -hmm. This is me. Oh, Not thick guys, very long. Hey, you can see my quads in there. That's my skeleton, and this is how I'm treating my skeleton. This is my skeleton, this is how I'm treating. <laughs> <laughs> you silly. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. Um, the mask is a measure of carbon dioxide and oxygen exchange. Um, from that, we're, we're able to determine what type of substrates you're using for energy, whether it's fat or carbohydrates or a combination of both. Um, and then we also can tell what your maximal heart rate is and then where those transitions um, occur so that you can do like zone two cardio, yeah. zone five, and you know what is the corresponding heart rate. Yes, all right, we're ready to get our results. Yay. Good business. Okay. Me. All right, so this first page here, this is all bone density. Um, you can see your youth adjusted T-score is a 3.1, which is excellent. This puts you way up here on this, uh, this particular scale. Um, so anything that's in the positive range is considered normal. We just wanna stay far away from negative one. Negative one is the precursor for osteoporosis known as osteopenia. And then you can see osteoposition page. So here you're gonna see your body fat percentage are at 15%, your fat in pounds you're at 21.8 pounds of total fat. Mm -hmm. Lean tissue, you're at a 123.8. Mm -hmm. And then BMC stands for just bone mineral content, fat free, fat free mass. But when we do comparison scans, we're always looking at those two. Um, you'll also see additional percentages. Your Android fat is excellent. You're at 10.2%, and your gynoid fat's at 16%. So your A to G ratio is um, 0.64. So that Very looks good. really good. Your body fat percentages per region. So you'll see in addition to the android, gynoid, and total from the previous page, arms, legs, and trunk. Trunk refers to the clavicle all the way down to the hip and does include that android number. So you'll see that your arms are at 15.9%, legs 17.7, trunk 11. Visceral fat being this innermost layer, we want this number as low as possible. Visceral fat is that stickier type of fat located closer to your organs, makes them harder to function. Mm -hmm. um, so you just want to make sure that that number is nice and low. Um, out of the total area that we're measuring, which is individualized to you, of 8 to 8.2 pounds, 7.2 is coming from lean, 0.8 is coming from fat, and of the 0.8, 0 0.00 is coming from visceral, so oh, okay. you can improve that number. <laughs> yeah. Oh, very cool. Okay, thank you. I don't know, Nicole Pay. No. Nicole Pay. Y'all let me know which one. Okay. <laughs> She's gonna pay for both of them. Okay, so we'll put, um, thank you. Thank okay, you. so both a doubled. I'm gonna pay test. anyway. Well, I just got you some shoes, so. What shoes? Steve oh, Maddie. those little shoes? Is that where expensive? Girl. Okay. I'm gonna put a jewelry at the house. Oh, I see. It was a hundred dollars for one or two for one yes, fifty. Yeah, I would need to reset something, but online. really good because initially I thought it was gonna be three hundred. I told y'all, but and the copay, okay, so that, that was so a win-win-win fucking win, 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 win. Okay. And we got our results, and this is just really great to know to to see your body and to say, okay, this is me. Period. You you can't lie. Scan don't lie. It don't lie. Okay. I think my scalp is, I mean, I got a wig on. All right, vlog, we made it back. Just had a great conversation with my sisters on the phone talking about the girls' trip for my bachelorette. That you, you, I gotta like put together a gift box for them, so we're gonna start to work on that. And I'm so excited, but anywho, body fat test went great. What I took from it, what I'm gonna do about it, is okay now i know where i'm holding fat and since i'm doing a bikini body the competition in a couple of weeks i can actually take this know where i'm holding it take an additional test to see what is the best and most effective way to burn fat um through another test that they have and then begin my workouts and focus them on just straight fat burning fat burning fat burning as i get into um closer to the competition. And I think this is incredible because you can really have a wealth of information to get to your goals so much faster other than me trying to figure out, oh, this is how I burn fat. This is really good for me, I think. Now, I know exactly where I hold fat, exactly how I burn it. Wow, and also, my stomach has zero fat on it. That's crazy. So, exciting day, but I will check with you guys tomorrow. That's it for the vlog today, bye. Yes, babe, bring the fast as well, Yes. Good, Naisa. Huh? Whoa. Yes. There you go, Naisa. Energy.